To them birds flying free Fish in the sea Flowers and trees Every little bumblebee I wanna sing It's your anniversary, November 18th. Happy anniversary. It's our anniversary. Happy anniversary, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary, happy anniversary. How long have you been married now? Forever. I'm gonna make you guys some pumpkin pie and you guys can sit and back and relax and watch some ABC. <laughs> <laughs> Sunday night special? <laughs> it's Monday night. Tell everybody what you saw last night. What was that we watched last night? What movie was that? The Apple Dumpling Gang. Yeah. What'd you think about it? I thought you watched up. It was okay. Oh, we watched up before that. But then the Apple Dumpling Gang, and I think it was what, 1975? Mm -hmm. And who is the two? Who is the? Who are the two actors? You remember who the the two uh, bad guys One was Theodore. Oh, I mean, what was their name? It was Don Knotts and Tim Conway. Yeah. Okay. And then, uh, gosh, man, what's his name? He played the Incredible Hulk. Mm -hmm. And I'm not talking about Bruce Banner. What was the guy's name? Played an episode of uh, Fantasy Island too. Well, anyway, he was in it. And by golly, it was just a real feel-good movie from 1975. I thought you said 73. Listen, I don't know. You have to go back and look and see. I don't even know what I'm talking about. I don't know. Happy anniversary, happy anniversary. We got some, where's the lids to these markers? I tell her they're gonna dry out. She's making sure everything's put in the right place. And um, she's trying to eat the zip ties, but I won't let her. Watch. <laughs> See, she's trying to get you. Oh, she's not as much right now. So, I like the baby cubes. For some reason, when I first started this thing up, it moved the arms like way over to the side and just left it there. And I was trying to get it to return to where it's supposed to be. So anyway, um, I got this. Um, this was the emergency order that I thought I needed. Spray rush order, which I ended up not needing. And then after I did it, I actually needed some other shirts. And so I haven't placed the order for the other shirts yet, which I need to because I believe one was like a one was like a ten day rush order. Um, so I'll have to. I usually place my order on Wednesday. I'll probably order a 
Wednesday order, but it'll probably be smaller. Let me push you back just a little bit. And I'll probably just order necessity because honestly, I probably don't need that many. I've got a bunch of, of shirts, including this order. Um, I ordered like a few. I thought I needed, the person ordered two size 10 shirts. I only had one on hand. So I went ahead and ordered two more just in case. So that way I'd have extra. But then they just ended up canceling one of the shirts because they actually didn't need it. Um, they bought a set with a ribbon trim and a shirt and then another shirt. And they only wanted the ribbon trim and the one shirt. And then they really didn't want you know. I guess they didn't technically want need the other shirt but was going to take it, you know. Anyway. Um, so I've got two of those now. Um, I needed, a, I had several orders for 4 tea, so I just went ahead and placed an order for like 4 of those because I think I had 4 orders come in. And then I had an order come in for a size 6, so I ordered an extra one of those. This is a size 8 boy shirt and I already ordered it. I didn't realize it. Which, um, they're out of like, they're short sleeves in a lot of the boys black shirts so um for sizes like 2t 3t and 4t i've been going to hobby lobby and using their um black t-shirts for 5t i've been ordering them off cavio um for like size six maybe not six what is it sizing is weird um seven maybe maybe it's five six seven eight ten twelve um, I've been going to Children's Place to get black. So, um, yeah, it's just, yeah, anyway, and then I ordered these for Journey. They're size 18 months. I want to make her some Christmas shirts. I just wish they had Sterling size. They go up to size 12. Sterling is more like a 16, um, it actually everything just depends on the maker um she can get size 14 16 some things at walmart and they're too small she can get 14 16s from target like cat and jack and they fit good um she can get some it just it all depends on them actually this looks really big too but it'll work i'm sure so i just got a plain red long sleeve my idea for this, oh no, Is this one, that one, this one, this one, yeah, okay. I have a Santa that I have put on a few of Sterling shirts before. I've done a shirt for her and I think I did a dress for her. Um, it's like a swirly beard Santa. I just love the design of it. Um, but he's red and, you know, he's pretty much red and white. He's got a red hat, white. So I wanted to do it on a green shirt for Jern, and I got the one. This one I got in the ruffle, and the red I just got plain. The red one, I don't know what I'm doing with it yet, but I've got tons and tons of Christmas designs that I've collected throughout the years, and I just really need to do it. I just need to make them. But anyway... So if that's the only thing I got in the mail today. I'm working on a my shirt, my, my shirt, my chair is broken. So it's like popping and cracking. It's cracked. Is what's wrong with my chair? Um, too many kids were playing on it, or maybe it could be me too. But I've had this chair forever, pro probably. Four or five years i don't know um but i'm making this ribbon trim right now and then after that one i got to work on a shimmer and shine is that shimmer and shine well these two shimmer and shine anyway got a lot of work to do it is me and my husband's anniversary um i think last year we didn't do much for our anniversary this year we're probably not going to do much for our anniversary i'm making chicken nachos um let me get some work done.